Hello and welcome! Guys, I hope you have your coffees ready. Today we are continuing our playthroughs of Night of the Full Moon. I hope you had a great day and I hope, I really hope that Mischief can give us the best of luck. Let's be honest here. Mischief, the best pet ever, the best card game pet. And uh, so, grab a coffee. Take a sip. Should we be spooky about this? I mean, it's not Halloween, but let's let's try and be spooky about this. Why not? Okay, no. Uh, let's let's uh, leave it at that. So I promised you guys a a oh man, what's it called? A hoax build, a prank, shuffling pen cards to the opponent and dealing damage up to that or a counter deck it depends on what we will get in the first few um in the first few blocks and pages let's see mastery of fire we know that already and a sorcerer snap we know that too crystallizing gains me three mana every turn so we might actually get that but you see most of our damage will actually come from the hoax which uh is a tag card and the cards that puts Prank cards into opponent's deck are also attack cards. So if we can go for that type of build, we kinda don't need that much mana, let's be honest here. I mean, having mana for Poker Dart is never too bad, but sometimes you'd just rather not. And Well actually the, the fun the funny thing I find is that the magician actually doesn't have that high cost cards, that many at least. And except of Balloon, which you'll never play at uh, its original six cost. So, you know what? Let's get let's get three mana every turn. That sounds fine. I mean, it's it's a really safe option. Let's be honest here. This draws me a card. I might actually gain the Painful Strike and the Magic Wand. What does the Magic Wand do? At the end of your turn, spells in your hand reduce their cost by four. That's kind of slow. And also, gaze triggers when the enemy plays an attack card, disables that card. Enemy gets frenzy times two. We'll leave that behind too. Hey, and. Ah, this is annoying. And you know what? I'll just gain this card. There's. Uh, oops, wrong button. I'll just take it. You know, more mana, more, more cards to open. And I hope I find a shop of which I kind of want to um, steal something. Now, trick, put three counter cards from your deck into play. That's um, not a bad card, even if we go for a uh, prank build but it seems that um, we are likely to, to go for a counter build you know it's never too bad having some some cards of one some cards of the other but uh yeah i mean triggers when the enemy plays an action card disable that card and gain its effects so yeah let's leave the reaction less behind and ooh, we get another speed card nice pocket watch nice hoodwing again um i said that I think more than often enough last time, but the Hoodwing Whip, it's probably the only, I mean, no, not taking it is actually a bad idea, right? Hey, don't Since stop here. you can just simply uh, trigger it with either Painful Strike or technically even Trick, if, if we were like that ballsy. But also, you know, uh, triggering Hoax three times or shuffling triple the prank cards into Children. opponent's deck wouldn't be the worst idea either so we'll be wasting the our ability as always isn't it you three cards from the enemy's top deck just want to copy yeah i'd leave that so let's try and fighting some maybe we get a, a better shot next time and this is unfortunately not a kill but pretty sure, oh the 25 percent oh we went for that build last time didn't we Ah, uh, what did we end with? A, I believe, what, 25%? Only a 25% chance that our opponent would uh, even try and hit us. Children um, for hey, all our hundreds of... Um, I am ordered to guard this place. Okay, not hundreds, no but for all room. our passive... It's all for your safety. Uh, passive dodge effects. Except, and even if they triggered a 20% chance to attack us, we would just have a Quicksilver ready, which spared us one more life, hey? So... I could take the hand, but as always, we are going to delete all these basic attacks, all these mana cards. So the only like useful things to upgrade would be 
uh, Poker Dog to make it cost zero and Enforcer to make it cost uh, no, no, to make six damage, I believe. So this is, seems very slow. I'll let, rather take the clear. Get rid of the mana. We don't, don't need that. Further. After that, we don't need that. Do -do 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 -do. A shrinking balloon sounds just beautiful. And okay, that was a waste. I was hoping that we would find another shop here, but um, let's the beggar. Why not? Don't go any further. By the way, we, we do have the charging staff, so if we find Poker Dart, we can just instantly trigger it and just draw through more cards. Not that we need that, but I don't have another. Yeah, I don't have another. You know what? Then in that case, I will just. Oh, I could have given that. I could have given him that. Oh, that. Oh man, that was so dumb. Oh, that was so dumb. Um, yeah, I mean, this was at least only three damage, so let's give him that. How dumb of me. Oh, gosh. Uh, you know what? Let's trigger this twice. And we could actually... You know what? Let's trigger this. So we don't, if we use this, we'll trigger... I mean, it says that it's... We obviously know what card it is, right? I mean, we just gave, gave it uh, to him. And so that would have negated an attack card, but uh, we were intelligent enough to play around it. So yes, let's upgrade Poker Dart. We don't need to waste money on this thing. Let's banish probably the other mana, right? Yeah, I mean our mana, our mana costs are like basically zero. We'll, you probably won't use this at the uh, high percentages. So I should really banish all the mana, or like half the mana source right there. <laughs> well, I mean, this thing gives five mana, and then this is uh, guaranteed to give you a give you a wisdom and draw one card. So, ah, <laughs> rip mana. Uh, I keep it around. Just as always, we can start banishing our basic attacks already instead of waiting around. But uh, yeah, perfect. We got the combo, and this is a death sentence. GG. Actually, could have used one of this fe these feathers. Uh, oh, we found hoax! We found hoax, boys! <laughs> Yo! <laughs> the pop-off, though. Now, we only need cards that uh, shuffle Takes some <laughs> to our opponent's number. deck. <laughs> if you can't find that, then it's uh, a little bit sad, but... Uh, sure, let's equip it from deck, draw two cards, and... <laughs> yeah, and also, uh, right, the thing also do does number six damage, so... Uh, and gives you six mana, so our mana base is more than uh, more than actually overpowered, right? Yeah. We'll get the pocket watch, by the way. Um, there's no reason not to get the pocket watch. It just the thing is just so strong. Get, having a 30% chance of getting another turn is is just amazing. Uh, and I should have had two max hand, right? Yeah, we do. I keep you know I keep the garbage in hand. And this looks like close to GG. Very unfortunate. You know, I'll use that. So if he uses, if he triggers our counter card, I didn't. And well, let's spam it out. Oh, let's yes, let's, let's use hoax on zero damage. <laughs> Why don't we? <laughs> oh god. So now, yeah, now we kind of need uh, prank cards. Like, what should we call it? Enablers? Just so we don't have to. I don't have to call them. I don't know, cards that shuffle praying cards into our opponent's deck is way too long. Maybe just enablers. So we need enablers and, I mean, having more hoax is, isn't necessarily bad, right? Can trigger it multiple times during a turn. I, okay, this was a uh, dumb thing uh, out of frequency. Out of, uh, not frequency, what I'm saying. Out of sequence. Sequencing. Um, there was some, some probably too high, a chance way too high for my liking of drawing the equipped card with uh, with the wisdom and uh, actually we were close to you know there's a possibility that you draw a card and it just so happens to be the one enforcer thus making your trick useless but hey uh, we could get one more action or enhancing what this thing and this will be banished so yeah we'll get the action I mean, we, you know, we have, uh, what, still a bunch of smithies around, well, you know, I kind of want a hoodwink, we need the hoodwink, actually, since, um, since, yeah, it will double and triple our hoax, so as I was saying, if, if we go for a just pure, um, pure counter deck, then yes, we kind of don't need, we wouldn't need the hoodwink, but since we're going for hoax and enablers, 
Yeah, um, Hoodwing tri tripling the damage output of Hoax, and actually even more damage since you shuffle more prank cards during it, during the combo. That's, uh, you know, yeah, not bad, not bad. Uh, will we get 15 coins? Yeah, right, we, we're gonna get 15 coins, right? Although I hope we get 15 coins. In s oh. <laughs> okay, uh, usual idiot, did you see? Yeah, so let's already... Put a prank card into our opponent's deck and pass. That sounds like a pass. Uh, yes, we can bait it out with one damage. Never too bad. And uh, I feel like we are actually not even killing here. <laughs> it feels like it, this will take a while. Uh, also, move one card from your deck to your hand. Just a basic pure search. Uh, not bad necessarily, but bait it out. Gain mana. Gain. Let's use the wisdom. Ah, uh, sure, I do this. Did I use the... Yeah, I did use it. Uh, we can use actually Poke Shark two times. And Hoax. I think she didn't have to discard the prank card, so there should be one in there. Yeah, there was one in there. Nice. Uh, do I have three max? Yeah, we do have three max cards. Okay. So, you know, the, the pocket watch on the main screen gave, gave me like some random buffs and whatever, whatnot. And... Uh, I don't know, I, I don't know them all by heart, so sometimes I, uh, I kind of forget. I think just uh, during the boss, during the first boss on chapter 1, you draw one more card, and uh, you will draw the same exact card. So it's not on all bosses you will draw one card, but Wolf Grandma will have you the same benefits that uh, you would have on chapter 2. So that, that's basically all. And let's see. Do we pocket watch? Ah, didn't trigger. Okay, hoax. Hoax is actually uh, it's actually working as it should. So that's that's nice. Uh, I could use two more times poker dart and oh no, you know what? You know what? Wait, wait, wait. Let's count it out. So if I use poker dart two more times, it would do four damage, letting me drawing me this card since we do have the wall equipped right now. Uh, that's another six damage. Makes ten damage. Thirteen, fifteen, uh, fourteen, and two more activation. That's six and seven. Is this enough? This could kill. And yes, yes, it's not. Nice. Get right, Wolf Grandma. You have been mapped. You have been mapped. Uh, no energy drink. Well, uh, you know, it's, it's late in the evening. We don't need the energy drink. And for the unfortunate thing is, if I use this, it's Lathmos, right? Lathmos. Yeah. So, uh, I would get just a charm that's, uh, not, not great. Uh, oh, now we can get this thing. Um,. Do I, want the, do I want the three random cards? I mean, what's the worst thing I could get? But you know, yeah, possess draws your card, so it's fine. Let's get three random cards. Another hoax? Yo, boys, we drew another hoax. What was it? Hoax? Uh, prophecy? That's that's great. Red squid and a second trick, so we can uh, combo off. Yo, this is probably the the Once luckiest run until now. Okay. Uh, you know, I don't want to eat my words later, but for chapter one, this hey, is basically no. the awesomest thing ever. What is your wish? Again, not going for chapter four, and having a negate would be fine, but, uh, you know, we are kind of stacking uh, a little bit too many uh, garbage deck cards. I mean, what is our deck? It's 19 cards, minus an equip card, 18, minus three draw cards, four, five, six, let's say seven, eight? Yeah, but it's it's like kind of a ten card deck, like a ten card va variability. And oh, the uh, I'll keep the smithy around as, as long as I can, just so potentially you know we can uh, upgrade something that is a little bit better than uh, than our basic attacks, or uh, you know even the enforcer. Like I don't care about the enforcer to be honest, doing six damage. That's uh, not good enough. And, uh, actually, now I have to. Oh, oh, nice, nice. Now we have the second target for Arcane Prophecy, so that's just amazing. Uh, do I triple the Painful Strike? Is there a better card? I could Hoax, doing zero damage the first time, doing three and doing six the, the third time. So that would be nine damage and giving three, three pranks into our opponent's deck. No, I'd rather Painful Strike having a triple. And now we have enough mana to basically, uh, still, I guess, do it all again. <laughs> Alright, 
Uh, so this has three, this has another three, and Poker Dot Prodigy. Hello, That's an FDK if I ever saw one. Nice! Nice! And still with all that garbage, with all this garbage still in there. Uh, let's look. Time off, and as you see, like, every time I have not made any other, like, runs to... To, uh, see more cards or to get more dust, it's just... For free. Uh, the right most card... Uh, 50% off. Uh, but, you know, if I find an enabler, I'd really like to copy that, actually. Or... Ooh, frailty times two. But that's only for one turn. Uh, you know, going for FTKs, you know... That wouldn't be bad if we went for like the real FTK. I mean the the the, the super build that we tried last time and failed miserably. <laughs> uh, you know, I'll just continue fighting and yeah, I kind of want to an enabler, fight an enabler and uh, shuffle that into the deck. Uh, let's get to random cards. Oh, we get another ho oh, oh. This looks blessed. Uh, yeah, I can't do anything with the arcane prophecy, right? Yeah, just gain a little bit of mana. Let's uh, use this thing, that's the second spell. So we drew four cards, nice. And yeah, I kinda basically can only hoax. Yeah, and deal the rest of the damage. Yeah, uh, I, I mean, technically we can. Oh, can we have the... Yeah, we... This is no fun. <laughs> GG, dwarf! <laughs> Get wrecked, Santa. <laughs> I was just thinking, you know, I hate that card. Um, it costs 20 for 30 damage, but uh, it's in like it's in the Magician build. Like in the, in the card pool of the Magician instead of, I don't know, the Witch. And, uh, you know, it, actually it would be quite underpowered for the Witch, let's be honest here. But it's it's really just badly balanced for the Magician since we don't gain like that, that much uh, mana, let's be honest here. But you know, when you draw it and you can't pull it off, that's uh wow, just wow. Another hoax, wow, wow. Okay, do we really want to stack up in a third hoax? I mean, there's really no reason not to. We're just like making our basic attacks broken with hoax, right? Or like, I mean, changing them up. But uh, what would it cost? Another forty coins. But that would mean. <laughs> Oh, wait, 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 wait. There is actually an achievement for having four times the same card except basic attacks. So I could just copy a hoax and buy another hoax and uh, say GG and uh, get the achievement for that. You know, I'll upgrade the Enforcer. That's probably the only card of those that uh, we'll keep around. This time, actually, I will use the um, next uh, intersection. Just so, you know, we can uh, at least, you know, there was a hope that we wouldn't see the same shop and the same... Uh, Elf thingy, but uh, you know sometimes uh, sometimes luck isn't on my side. We can't be having all luck all the time, right? That's bad. By the way, it's really weird that uh, actually hoax does do the um, the sound for a piercing, even though we do zero damage. But yeah, having having a su supporting like shuffling to pranks would be really. Uh, first arcane, okay, which it searches to possess. You don't want to draw it uh, with the wisdom. You know, wisdom is fine and all, but uh, sometimes, some of the time, you want to be uh, a dumb idiot. You don't, you don't always want to be a twenty thousand IQ warhead. Okay, let, let's stop with these memes, man. Let's stop it. Uh, oh, this is a back. This is a bad hand. <laughs> this is a really bad hand. Should I reset? Uh, I feel like I will die. Just, just saying. Uh, let's just enforce. I'll keep the hoping for. Uh, I don't know what exactly, to be honest. But oh, I could have. Oh yeah, I could have copied this thing. Having two um, stone strikes would have been yeah, quite nice, quite nice. But yeah, magic pocket first. Now basic attacks and you know prophecy. Oh, we get a free turn. Nice. That's already great. So I will actually get prophecy. To have possess, draw me a card with possess. Draw me two cards with this, and uh, you know the actually. Oh no, we have an enforcer in there. Okay, so yeah, the problem about hooting it gets exiled. So check will only only put an enforcer down and uh, just pass turn basically. And this is poker dot gg. Actually, we could just pass, right? <laughs> I mean, free turn. It's the first time we don't use one of our free turns. That's, uh, absurd. Oh, we even have a inspiration. Okay, but. 
The thing is, instead of drawing us one random card, it would have the possibility of giving us... Okay, what exactly? A draw two, a draw two, or a poker dot, which you can use two times and... Yeah, okay, that's... Sure. There's no reason not to get an inspiration. Um, as clear as crystal, in the world of water, water I, dominate. I dominate. Well, in the world of water, I don't give a shit. Yeah, let's... Uh, oh, nice. So we... This will be... Oh. <laughs> yeah, sure. Uh, let's continue, why don't we? <laughs> oh, we only do two cards with the thing, but... Uh, do I hoodwink the payphone strike? I should, right? The thing is, if I find a hoax... Okay, wait, wait, wait. Um, Painful Strike, tripling with Hoodwink deals 18 damage. Uh, yeah, 18 damage. Or if I triple hoax and find another hoax, the first does 0, then 3, then 6, then 9. That's uh, 12, that is exactly 18 damage. It's just, just the same. But we have uh, the privilege of giving our opponent two more uh, prank cards. So, eh, not necessary, I believe. Let's draw two cards. Possess. And you see, we didn't even find the hook, so uh, that wasn't worth it. Can we use it five more times? We can, actually. I didn't math perfectly, like I didn't think about it, but yeah. Seems fine. FTK, the world of water guy. Nice, nice. I presume. Don't waste my. There is no choice for either of us. Are you sure about that? I mean. I can draw more cards. Oh, sad. If I didn't have this... Gosh, darn basic attacks! <laughs> oh, God! Okay, we'll, we'll hoax it. Uh, doing 12 damage. Uh, 9 damage, sorry. And... Uh, I'll keep this in hand, right? Yeah, no, no need to draw those. Uh, have a splitter, sure. Banish your own cards. Actually, this this guy would be fun for the mechanic. Maybe you can uh, pull it off on on this guy banishing his old deck. Remember, there was uh, the one card that banishes like the next card or like one card from your opponent's deck, just for for free. And uh, maybe maybe like triggering that a bunch of times on him and he helping you with your strategy would be necessarily bad, right? Uh, so let's trick. We can get one more card, and we'll as always gain the prophecy. Oh, we got an inspiration. So. Draw two cards, sure, get even the wisdom, draw another two cards, uh, namely just the hopes. And this looks like another GG. I actually didn't have to throw the dark, but uh, hey. More damage is never bad. Game on health for each five damage you deal, that's uh, probably take this. I get one weapon slot. You know, I, I feel like we don't need a second slot, To be, let's be honest here. What, uh, what good equipment does the magician actually have? I mean, there are some. Okay, there are good. Let, let's say not. Let's not say that they are bad. Just not necessarily good for our build. Let's put it this way. So I'll take the vampire codex. Um, I find it actually quite difficult playing sometimes with. Or sometimes playing with the magician. Whenever you don't FDK, it's uh, mighty annoying ha having to, uh, you know, like. Having the max difficult. Okay, I'm. I'm. As always, I actually say that this guy isn't bad to fight. And, you know, talking too long, and, well, he ended our turn. Unfortunate. But yeah, some of my time, some of my runs actually died to the Magician, because whenever you can't FDK, the problem about this class is that it simply doesn't have um, any healing power. Or, I believe at least. Uh, I used the second thing, but he's gonna die anyways. Um... Okay, let's let's talk with Calm. <laughs> you know, Calm's spelled with an A, spelled with a K in uh, in like surreal memes style. Yeah, no, um, I find it sometimes difficult because the magician barely has any healing. I, I think I believe there is really nothing that can heal you actually, and so having at least something, having this every, doing every five damage heals you, twenty percent healing power on everything, Looking is like uh, actually a welcome addition. You can defend yourself. And, you know what, I'll just pass with this, since uh, he draw cards. Well, actually, I mean, the first card he plays will take damage for it. It, it isn't just simply copied, but yeah. And, um, hmm. What thing do I want to triple? Probably hoax. Oh, we can draw hoaxes, actually. If he draws prank cards, that'd be... <laughs> it'd be just so funny. Um, But actually, I should probably copy Painful Strike, right? 
Right, but how many cards does he have? Four. I could just use my hands. No. Let's go for hoax. You know what? Yeah, let's go for hoax. That sounds fine. Mighty fine. And I think you have three max heart. Yeah, so let's just pass. And let's possess. Ooh, another hoax. Nice. That's uh, we already have nine damage for hoax. Ah, he he discarded the prank card though. Sad. Uh, let's poke it up. Draw two more cards. Thank you very much. Uh, I already have this, so you know, I, now I kind of have to discard. So we might as well just use up the trick. Yeah, just so it's not in deck. Pass, and uh, you know, kind of we need to speed up the damage. So let's hope we draw stronger. Yeah, obviously I don't have spells. I know that. Yeah, the mana was just to gain it, just so I can uh, freely use all the cards. It's the swell now. Nice. Nice, nice. And let's add the other hoax. This should do 15. Man, I am just wrecking this guy. Let's pass turn. You know, we could just, you know, force out the magic pocket watch by uh, <laughs> using it like a 20, 20 hundred times. And let's got, you know, let's get the inspiration. And yeah, there we go. We can draw this again. And. Hoax for 18 now. Uh, sure, let's spam out poker a few more times. You know, this is the killing turn, since we can just hoax From once more. On, and I knew we had the hoax, since, you know, we have two hoaxes. One I drew, the other one was still there. The uh, could we find, you know, should I just really get the fourth hoax? Yeah, you know what? F this. F this. Plant is no plague on the hoax. We'll buy the other one as soon as you can. Namely, not yet. Um... This actually, uh, it exiles them. Ooh, but I actually like acrobatics, right? This could be just a final killing blow on everything. When you know you have three more, when you know you have three more hoax in deck, and uh, I mean you can just calculate the damage. Let's say you know, just like against the giant, the last three damages were 12, 15, and 18. No, 15, 18, and 21. That's uh. What? Uh, 5, 6, and 7 times 3. So that's 11, 18 times 3. 30 and 54 damage. So you kind of know, okay, uh, my opponent should have an X amount of hoax cards. And you just acrobatics. Acrobatics those things. <laughs> Sounds really bad though, right? Uh, I shouldn't get this. But it's it's not in the card index right now. So I... Ah, you know, the, the, the completionist is aspect of it is... May, might be just too strong. Huh? And oh, again, we didn't trust the crossbow. Hasn't come this Please, uh, I... oh wait, certain just attack. Oh, we we found another error. <laughs> so sad. But yeah, let's shuffle a card and pass. Uh, I think the thing resets. So next turn, I should be, I should be able to start with uh, an attack card instead of having to start with something else. So that sounds great. And you know, basic attack, poker dart. Basic attack, poker dart. Nice. Uh, basic attack, possessor draw card. Yes. Now we need a spell again. And let's hoax. Draw two cards. And just a trick. Don't want to set the hoodway. I'll keep it in hand, just for next turn. But yeah, I mean, we have a pretty good matchup against this guy, since uh, we can, we have, we have a bunch of different cards, what, what, like, one, two, three, four, five different types of cards, so, that's, uh, I'd say actually guarantee, isn't it? So, this one gives me another mana, so that's why I used it first. Now we draw a spell, such that we have a second. We hoodwink, we hoax. Okay, now we wisdom, we hoax. Then we prophecy... We hoax. We draw two cards. We hoax. We poker dart. We hoax. Without <laughs> me, you GG. Like that uh, that sounds like a song, is, doesn't it? And uh, let's clear. I, again, I kinda, you know, these chances of getting more equipment slot isn't. It's actually quite. We, we got quite a lot of. Uh, like quite a lot of times the ask asked me. The game asked me if I wanted more more slots, and I still still said no. Oh, you gaining even more frailty. This could be really fun. You know what? I'll get the prophecy first. 
Oh, you even find the best way. Okay, that's hoax for for zero, then for three and for uh, six. Poker drop twice to draw two cards. We hoax for nine. Draw two more cards. We hoax for twelve. Seventeen. Ah, yeah, you know what? Uh, I don't count this thing, but uh, you know what? I'll just do. Okay, I don't have that much uh, mana, so that's it'll pass. You know, I want to be able to uh, activate at least a pocket watch next turn, if necessary. Or if possible, that way. And we don't have any more counter cards since we still have this thing. Uh, let's draw one more card. Uh, sure, these tricks, man. <laughs> these tricks. Uh, you know what? I'll just activate them to shrink down the balloon. And. Ah, this was bad luck. Very bad luck. We'll do. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, this is really costly now. Seven. I should have probably not used, not made that for that little bit more damage. Wouldn't, wouldn't have been necessary. To be honest. Now, how much is this hoax? Sixteen. So it was a hoax for fifteen, plus one frailty. So uh, hoax for twenty now, and you know we are we are close to GG. Uh, actually, a hoax should be enough to kill. Uh, okay, close. Never mind. Oh, he should have. Poker Dart. There we go. <laughs> but you know, Poker Dart doing like six, seven damage with uh, because of the frailty is actually okay, quite a. Uh, actually, it's a broken. Okay, like now, okay, not broken, but uh, you you know what I mean. Uh, Omni Slice, Firewall, five finger discounts. Triggers when a counter card is triggered. Steal a card from your opponent. That sounds so slow. Okay, you know what? I mean, since this time we're going for the hoax build, uh, I might just as well say that next time we'll go for a counter build. But you know, that will take a week. Or something, I something like that. Uh, we can get Ghost Card to have a, um, a second trigger of another spell card, but it would be really sad if Inspiration just threw you that thing and you didn't have another other spell. And just like losing out on the draw two from uh, Inspiration would be sad. Triggers when the enemy plays an attack card. Get one in front of the enemy's hand. Uh, how about no? Gain seven mana and two action. That's a uh, that's all the mana actually for one card alone. Well, let's leave that behind. Let's see what the later on the the thing, the thing. Yeah, sure, the thing, the thing, man. Now what's it called? The um, the witch has in store for us. Let's see that. Also, uh, next counter card. It's uh, either a hoodwink like hoodwink enabler, I guess, uh, for the full FTK doing frailty as we did last time and failed miserably. I'm just saying that again. Just uh, you don't forget. I mean, you will never forget that I lost with the first magician, right? Yeah, you you will never forgive me for that. But that aside, you know, if we if we play more counter cards, then sure. But you know, kind of the thing is still inspiration has a 100% chance now to get net us two draws with either either four one by using poker dot twice, or well six or probably actually around closer to around two mana. Uh, let us draw two cards for that minimum amount of mana. So I don't want to don't put like lethal stab and things like that in there. But yeah, we found the other hoax. Now we have four, and thank you for achievement. We have four hoaxes in deck. Can we now can please read, find a better enabler imagine. for that? I mean, actually, I could banish a trick. Let's be honest here, but I don't care about three damage, and we'll eventually banish trick too. Uh, yeah, I should keep this around. By the way, we haven't even actually used the first like non-free amnesia tavern, so we might at one point just use it for these two and trick. But you know, we have the full chapter in front of us, so I'll be deleting it for now. So sure, restore me, restore me four health at max health. Why don't you? And I should I. I get just one, okay? You know, but it's health. Uh, we don't, we don't necessarily need that. We have healing now. We have healing. And what does she give me? Fencing. Nice. Okay. Your opponent having a pure. Oh, we found an enabler. We found one. And actually, stage play doesn't sound bad either. Um, I mean, there's really no reason not to get this. And if you, if you're lucky enough, you find even an, actually another. Imagine you hoodwink the stage play. I mean, that happened last time actually on the on the retries on the last on Mystery Man. You with um, there was the one spell that copies we just left behind right now that uh, copied hoodwink and then we copied stage play with hoodwink and stage play giving us then uh, I think both of those like both of the extra copies of stage play gave us another hoodwink 
and well, you can imagine how much uh, storm strike frailty that becomes. So we might get that later, but at the start of the turn, play one counter or attack card from your deck. Again, nice support, we don't need that though. I'll get the town clown trick. Should I use my freebie? Or do I want to bow this and this? You know, just you know, pay 40 for the tech card for the counter attack and acrobatics. Uh will be What's this called actually? Appropriation, okay. Don't miss it. Uh you know what? I'll I mean if not in this game, against like in this build with what build would we use such a card? Let's be honest here. That's just made for this stuff. Hmm. Oh, but no, okay, well, the problem is it could just trigger tricks, which trigger nothing since we only have these two, okay. Uh, this tab can go. Uh, let's... Oh, okay, I should have actually thought about this. I mean, at one point I would get this thing, right? So, and I knew this thing would come. Uh, let's use the blood. As always, I said the last time, we'll most likely always use that thing. Let's fight. It doesn't matter if uh, we lose one charge. Let's be honest here. Uh, we haven't triggered it yet once. Like, okay, no, we triggered it once, but it wasn't really necessary, let's be honest. And, uh, okay, give me a process. Oh, yes, we clown trick, and we copy clown trick. Actually, should have focused, maybe. Uh, you know, wait, 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 now... Our opponent has what? We use three of the clown tricks, making it six six cards, and this should do 18. 19. 19. Yeah, fencing. Yeah, obviously, obviously. Uh, let's poke it out twice to draw more cards. Um, trick does nothing. Sure. This ends our turn. Okay, that's actually less impressive than I was thinking. But, you know, we have a bunch of pokes right now. Uh, we will be triggering way too much. So that's put still six and hoax shuffled one and she just got just right now one. Will actually I just wait. You know, we might draw the clown trick and then the ho these hoaxes will do just a bunch more damage. Let's pocket watch first. Uh, let's use the tricks just to shrink down this thing. Oh we get free jet. Oh nice. nice. Um I'm pretty sure this opponent is gonna die. And oh uh, yeah, I don't have one. Okay. Uh 22, 25, 28! Return. Come on, draw me more, draw me more hoaxes. This is, I mean, I am two hoaxes away from winning the game outright. One hoax away from winning the game outright. Correct, you know, you know, um, Resident Evil 3, the remake. <laughs> Correction, just like the, the, the Russian guy said. Co correction, ah, undead. So, yeah, um... We ended our game with 52 mana. <laughs> sure, let's get the health. There's no reason to get the thing. Um, still keeping this around? We can now drink. Oh, you know what? We might fight a mimic. Never know. Um, triggers when the enemy plays a damaging card, counter a drawing card. Again, the thing is, you kind of don't want to add garnets, but you kind of want to add garnets, so the trick at least does something. So, you know what? We'll just get it. Just so trick triggers. Let's give him this thing. Uh, I want to get rid of that instantly. Draw an attack, spell, and monocard from your deck. Wow. And we can even use both. Spell, attack, and mana. So, either... So, you will be guaranteed a draw 2. A counter card. And a... Oh, a mana card. So... Either this thing that either draws you one card or gives you another one of these, which draws you two more cards. And one attack card. So as soon as we get rid of this thing, and maybe even the tricks or like one trick, it will semi-guarantee us. Like, I mean, you know, we have four hoaxes, one clown trick and uh, two more cards, assuming we banish trick on basic attack. That's four out of seven. A 50% chance on a... On a... Um... Don't miss it. Never mind. Uh, you know what? I'll leave the stage play. I'll just keep this thing around. We'll, we might, you know, you look, look at me now finding a new, uh, in the next shop, another freaking hoax. Uh, ooh, let's, ooh, double damage. Ooh. <laughs> or healing. Healing is actually pretty safe, but, uh, this should trigger, what? Uh, you do three, you do six, you do nine. 
on the 12th you will do 24 and then go back to 18. I mean Trample does only 20, 12 more damage during the whole game. Oh, now that I think about it, um, wait, this here is 20%? Right. You know what, let's, let's just go all out. Damage and see me regret this later. Um, yeah, this is the, the, shuff, the like changing things. Triggers when the enemy plays an additional spell card. The card returns through the hand and they lose all action and mana. Yeah, that, again, good against... Good against Demoness, but okay. Check these out. Shuffle one prank card to enemies. Oh, okay. Now we found something. We finally found something. Uh, but uh, you know that can wait, right? Where or should I already get it? The thing is now I've, I've said no to so many... To so many equipment slots. Finding one now is... Pro very unlikely. No, wait. Uh, how do I... No, I probably have to... I have to level up. To, and uh, we might then at that point get it, but uh, that's unlikely to say the least. So let's clown trick. I actually can use that thing since we won't be um, activating that next turn, and I'd rather draw two cards. Or like, see another card and don't ha not have to discard it. And the damage is just more compelling. And uh, I'm pretty sure she's gonna die next turn since we've, we um, were lucky enough to keep the changeling. Oh, another thing about it. Actually, I, I said we can use both of these, the Prophecy and the Changeling. And the fun thing is, if you draw Prophecy, you can just add it, add um, the Changeling to your hand. And that makes it your second. So that's that's going to be broken, maybe. Most likely. And yeah, you see, we drew double, we, do, we drew double draw two cards. So that just is amazing. And how do we have so many cards in there? It feels like feels like we have way too many now. Um, oh, I have a hoodwink right now. So probably hoax first. No. Wait, oh no, I do. Oh, this is not the hoodwink. This is the other thing. Yeah, yeah right, 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 right. Wait, do I have a hoodwink? I, I, did I? Oh no, I have it here. Oh, I'm an idiot. <laughs> so let's count it first. Hoodwink, hoax, and hoax five more times. GG. <laughs> <laughs> this is just broken. <laughs> we find the we find a good build, man. We found a freaking good build. And just instantly regretting it. Well, I mean, that's fifty percent damage, right? And yeah, we use trample already, so that's nice. Very nice. Uh, what was this thing? So for health, yeah, yeah, sure. That's uh, we don't care about this. So let's... There should be two in our deck now? Yes. Yes, that's a good thing. At least if they are triggered, they're back in deck and we can trigger them instantly out of deck. So let's draw two. Let's changeling. Yeah, sure. I, I know I don't have spell. <laughs> Just through the poke dot. And... This is gonna be GG. From the amount of hoaxes we have. The snow monster yeah. is in love with the stone. This is... I, I mean, I really, I really love the hoax deck, to be honest. I uh, actually always thought that it was kind of inconsistent, but I mean, I guess if you draw that many hoaxes, that's... I take it back. Against this guy, this could be a actually a really bad thing. So I probably need to actually keep like all the combo pieces in hand and use them all in one turn, because in any other case, they're not gonna trigger. <laughs> yeah, yeah, again, the first at least does zero damage to him. So basically, it does zero damage to me. Oh, it's kept at one. Nice. Okay, okay, okay. Um, obviously, none has triggered, so they are still around here and can use trick. So let's change it. Now, what do I actually want to have in hand? Like, what do I want to bait it out? Oh, yeah, poke it out. I can always bait it out with, like, low damage amounts. So let's poke a dodge. Then clown trick. Uh, okay, we have baited it out. Thus, we can prophecy for what? Inspiration to draw two more cards. No, prophecy to inspiration. Like, prophecy guarantees you inspiration, guarantees you this thing. And I will draw one to two more hoaxes. So, uh, okay, prophecy. This is such a big brain. Oh, oh, yeah. One, one other. The other hoax is still in deck. Um, oh, we, oh, we triggered another accelerate. Oh, okay, man. I'm sorry. Phantom Captain, you are just 
Oh gosh. You have just been annihilated. Actually, maybe even in this turn. Oh, really close. No, no, not this. Oh, man. <laughs> oh, GG, man. GG. You were just really wrecked. Oh, is the big horn guy. Will this guy be a problem for us? Maybe if we do this garbage. <laughs> I'll keep the trick. Uh, just because they will probably. Yeah. Both are triggered. Hopefully, I don't draw them for turn. Such a trigger will be at its max utility. Let's see. And I drew a hoodwink. Okay, uh, 12 of 3 is good too. And yeah, by the way, Shrinking Balloon goes down by 3 just because I use Trick and these two are counted as used. Thus uh, lowering it even more. Changeling. And sure. Ah, uh, yeah, I don't have spells. Um, I should have known that. Do I have one more? Yeah, I should have Possess. Yes. And we found three other four hoaxes. We found four other four hoaxes and clown trick. Yeah, we have full combo. Hoax, 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 and hoax. Full combo achieved. Actually, what did it do? Like 120 damage? Eh, that's uh, I mean 120 for a one turn combo, and next turn you are most and more likely than not on uh, triggering it once more. So, you know, that's changeling <laughs> just for the hoax. <laughs> Nothing else, only draw hoax. Oh yeah, oh, that was actually quite unlucky. Uh, quite lucky that I didn't draw the counter guard. And we still have a shrinking balloon that's drawing us the last hoax. And, well, this turn hoax is gonna do, what, 31, 34, and GG. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> oh, we created a monster. Now, is there actually even something to upgrade? Uh, just one, namely Inspiration, which gives us the, just two more mana, so we, that can... Oh, yeah, we can keep the basic attack in hand, in deck, sure, sure. Uh, let's get the action. I'd actually, at this point, I would have been happy with a uh, equipment slot. But uh, you can't have everything, right? No longer control right, apps. Changeling, and... Prophecy for what? Uh, probably Arcane Prophecy in 50-50 in Inspiration. And Pocket Watch. Yeah. And now, trick for the last counter card. Draw two more cards. Um, possess. Clown trick. Is there, there is still a hoax. Yes. And I can't draw any more cards. So, we'll be stuck at this. Um, you know what? I may actually even still kill him. Ten more times. Uh, no, right? No, this... Won't be enough. Does free? Ah, oh, yeah, fencing. Fencing does it. Yeah, this will be enough in that case. <laughs> Just enough, actually. If we didn't get, uh, if we didn't have fencing, that I couldn't have killed him with poker guard. So actually, wow, that uh, was really lucky to get get it at some point. I mean, at this point, I could. Ah, oh, no, and I don't. I still can't get it. Ah, oh, how unfortunate. Because I want my 100% chance on. Uh, on uh, inspiration to draw me a draw two. You know what? Let's just go for it. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. This we never take it. Now I have in the card no. index. GG. <laughs> That's all I want. And uh, we buy it at this point. Actually, we have a third one. We could I could get to. I could still get spring cleaning, but let's be honest. What do you want to actually discard? There's nothing we want to discard except well, basic attack and a trick. But we'll be banishing those. So yeah, this thing can go. Um, draw cards until you reach max hand size. Yeah, same thing as spring, kind of the same thing as spring cleaning. Also, this thing is not needed. Uh, copy the left mouse card. Yeah. Oh, another demon mirror. Oh. Oh. Okay. Okay. Now. Now we are just. Now we are just. Uh, overreaching, maybe. Uh, trick. Prophecy for changeling. Where is it? Changing also guarantees me a draw too, and I say really guarantee even if you don't have the charge staff because you will get. Oh no, it doesn't anymore. Yeah, right. I have this thing. <laughs> I take it all back, oh, and we find an extra turn. So nice. Actually, I'm wondering if this thing will trigger. Well, at the start of your turn, and since I'm taking an extra turn, I believe this should trigger. 
Uh, yeah, no mind. That was stopped for me. Should I now really hot wink on the clown trick? <laughs> Let's go. Let's go. And. <laughs> Free turn? What is that? Why would we need that? <laughs> oh, now I don't know if, if Demon Mirror actually triggers. puts um, puts one more in deck. Not in deck. Um, yeah, you know what I mean. Uh, okay, this is a really costly Shrinking Balloon now. Or do I give up a little bit of host damage? Just to keep one mana? Nah. Changeling. Wisdom. Uh, what to get now with Prophecy, actually? Now, you know, the thing is, I can't go Prophecy into Inspiration into Pocket Watch. Or, I mean, there's a 50 50, but. Should we go for a 50 50? Yeah, let's go for a 50 50. A 50 50. We did get obsessed. Okay, so, ah, uh, yeah, yeah, obviously it's less than 50 50, but. Uh, you get my point. And now we have the Hoodwick. Do we again Clown Trick? Yeah, we go Hunter Clown Trick first. And actually, I should just try and remember to not um, overkill. Uh, just so, yeah. yeah. It's literally overkill, right? Obsession. Okay, rebound, sub lethal. Uh, the sub lethal damage will be dealt to me back, but uh, that should be too much of a problem, right? We could have already send less. Oh now, oh now he has the passive damage on. Oh, be wary, be wary, my friends. Uh, let's trick such as they are. The, the two things, counter cards are out of deck. Then we pocket watch. No thirty percent. Okay. This thing for changeling. Yeah, I know I have no spell, but it's still going. It's still plus. Now we clown trick. Then we thirty-seven. Uh. 40, 20 left. 22 left. I could use Poker 20, 7 times. Okay, less time since I can you make this happen. Yeah, you know, I just I don't want to necessarily have to take uh, that much sub lethal damage, so. We'll use this 3 times. 2 more times. 1 more time, taking 0 back. Taking 3 back. Okay, so the sub lethal main means. Not sub lethal, but. You know, not just. Uh, just like overhealing. Uh, but just backwards as damage. Uh, it's it's just the last damage we do we take back. So there's no spell, right? Okay. So we hoax. We could send blast, but probably the next hoax will be a bit too strong in that case. Let's just do this. Eight passive damage. Sure. Let's hoax now. Oh no, okay, yeah, I can just take 3 damage, that's easy, and now Hoax does way too much damage, so <laughs> I can't actually use that. <laughs> I really actually can't use that, but, I mean, we can Clown Trick just to shrink the balloon. Gain a little bit of more mana, and, uh, yeah, I probably should use this thing. 11 more damage, and we only have Hoaxes. I just wanted the mana there. You know, I just I just don't want to overdo it with the damage I take back. And yeah, I can't use this anymore. We pass, you know, just throw away the hoaxes. <laughs> you know, we are we are so, we have our hoax so strong that we can't even use it because we die ourselves. So yeah, it's not just I didn't want to take the damage, it's just like we would die taking the damage. Mana cost increased by three. Oh, mm. not a dream mirror, dude. Okay, okay, stop it, stop it. Okay, this game was. This game is setting me up. I, I just didn't take all these demon mirrors, and now they just just spam me. Like I, I didn't take the the slots, and now they spam me with good good things for us. For frick's sake, man. And we hope the best, not the Zen. Ah, yeah, that's why I kind of didn't want to get the Zen blast. Just so it was, it didn't have to be this way. But you know, like I realized you were just like me, trying to make history. And just you know, if if you want to have more, uh, more freaking references to, uh, what's it called? Uh, Metal Gear Rising Revengeance, you know. Yeah, you're, you're fighting Senator Armstrong, and uh, oof, 
trying to make history there. What do we bait it out? Probably actually Demon Mirror. Right? Yeah. Let's bait it out with Demon Mirror. Wisdom Drama Card. Uh, I will copy the, the clown trick. Oops. Changeling. Uh, they all have triggered? Yeah, they have triggered. So let's use trick. Do I have a spell? Style? Oh, we do still have a spell. Okay. Let's roof this. And. Poke it up to draw two more. And I'm pretty sure I'm going to KO my opponent with these three. There we go! By the way, have you seen how much money we have? I like have 217 points. Just out of nowhere. <laughs> Just because we got all the cards from, I don't know, copying, like, copying the more hoaxes and giving, having them as rewards and whatnot. Uh, this is, again, a bad-ish hand. So fortunately we have enough like starting mana kind of to um, use the balloon. That's that's a lead what a thing. No, I'll just copy hooks. Just so we start putting some prank cards and like have some mini gates. Did you draw at least some? Oh you draw two! Oh 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 you draw two. And you know, prophecy for nothing. Since I you know I already used the the possession, so actually, we really kind of don't need this demon mirror, let's be honest here. But you know, if I delete it, then probably I get this, this level up level up reward and just uh, have to be sad about it. We are one exp off, sure. I could buy this. <laughs> Shall we go for the memes and just buy the level ups? And even though we can just fight, fight for it. Yeah, uh, yeah, why didn't I close actually this page? Uh, <laughs> I mean, just for fun. <laughs> for frick's sake. Uh, no, no. Come on, Let, let's not be that meme. You know, a thousand subscribers, we go for the memes. We we'll go for the memes. And this, by the way, was also just bad. Actually, I should have. Yeah, dude, I am always copying that thing. So why didn't I <laughs> copy this time? How dumb for me. Sure. We draw one more. We draw it again. Oh, the first damaging card, right? Right. I use all the mana, so I kind of need to keep one of these in hand at the end. So what can we do? Oh, I mean, I can just strike this heavy six mana back. Yeah, yeah. That that sounds fine. That sounds fine. Um. Ah, oh, Zen Blast. Zen Blast. Actually, now that I think about it, probably is Zen Blast first. Since, you know, after I use it, we'll still be at zero mana. <laughs> anyway, so <laughs> we might just as well. Yeah. Yes, yes, yes. yes. Yeah, right. There's really no reason not to go for that. Uh, use the Enforcer. Then we Shrinking Balloon. Since, again, it's for free. There's still one. Yeah, there's still one. So let's use that. And on. Very unfortunate we didn't draw. Oh, yeah, no, th dumb. Ah, that was dumb for me. Okay. In that case, we'll just copy the hoax. And uh, this will probably kill anyways. Oh, we're really close. No, oh, okay, we can we can just poke it <laughs> Getting the six, six mana back from. Um, <laughs> getting the six mana from the painful strike is actually. <laughs> MVP there. Uh, yeah, sure, I want the stab attack at 6 damage in chapter 3. Yes, thank you, RNG. Uh, sure, it draws you a card. Uh, actually... Actually, it was maybe not the best idea. Because now Changeling has... I mean, it's still... Instead of 4 in 7, it's like 4 in 8 from uh, on a hoax probability, but... A good weapon may be uh, Smithy on Inspiration? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Smithy on Inspiration. Grandiose. Uh, what's in the shop? Gain two temporary copies of the next counter card you play. Shall we just get that? Next spell card takes effect two more times. Invalid for float. Or three. Uh, frailty three. So you know, actually, on this card, it's it's written the enemy takes three additional damage this turn, but they still put the reminder text of what frailty is. But it wasn't. It, frailty is not written on the card. What are you, what are you talking about? So yeah, I kind of want a puppet tricks. Um, just because. 
I mean, you know, if you copy Hoodwig with this thing, that's that's amazing. And we can still activate it the same turn as we uh, use the other two. So, yeah, not bad, not bad. And float. You know what? Let's, we'll do it this way. And we finally banish the last basic attack. Now I kind of want to keep both of these. Use the best. But, okay, no, let's be honest. What, what am I going to... We have all at full power. Nothing can be upgraded anymore. So, and I'm not... Most probably not gonna buy any more cards. Um, healing extra stuff. Do I banish a trick? I probably should, right? Right, let's banish a trick. Do I want to banish another thing? Do I want to banish sense? Oh, now, now that I think about it, uh, inspiration now gives me float too, so we have actually worsened our deck kind of. I mean, it's fine, right? It's, it's gonna be fine. I'll banish the dream, Demon Mirror. Since... What's really gonna do? Add 3 damage? That's really not enough. But... Okay. Adding 3 damage on each hoax. That's a little bit different. But yeah. Uh, <laughs> why even buy it if you don't delete it? Eh, you know. <laughs> don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Ah, yes. Double Spring of Life. Okay, so I didn't have to use it. Actually. Taste it. My Let's... Yeah, and the rest in the mana. Oh, yeah, I mean, this guy gives me some money too, so. Maybe yeah, I could have got, gotten a little bit more health with it, but. Okay, what am I looking for? I am trying to combo puppet tricks with the hoodwink and with the um, clown trick. That's that's the idea. Here. Oh, yes, sure. Let's uh, drop two more cards. Oh, we even got it! We got it! Oh god, oh god. Uh, we can't even trick for all three of Oh no, oh no, now I can't. <laughs> okay, you know what? No, 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 I can't accept this. I can't accept this. <laughs> I can't accept this. Wait, not this thing. Continue. <laughs> I can't accept this misery. <laughs> this amount of misplaying behavior. I can help you. Did we actually get the same cards? I don't know, man. Yeah, I think we did. No, we didn't. No, 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 no. We, we surely didn't. What am I saying? That's really sad. Now we got only BS. Sure. Probably, actually, if I used float now, the like idea would be kept there, and I could use the effect of the float I used last turn, anyways. But you never know. Let's be honest. Now. You know, I have to wait with Hoodwink until we... Uh, you know what? I could just get the combo with Clown Trick, but I'd rather just Changeling. Hope for the chance, and if we don't get it, it doesn't matter. Since we have a bunch of other draw cards. Yeah, there you, there you go. So... I didn't use three. Oh, come on! Come on! <laughs> oh, this is so sad. You know what, let's just use 30 mana for, what, 90 damage, sure. F this. <laughs> I just used the hoaxes. Uh, actually, I could, I should have used this first, and the problem I can't use, oh no, I can, I can use this. Yeah, that's still hoax. <laughs> Rip the combo, but hey, doesn't matter. Uh, we'll get it next turn. Most probably it's gonna not be triggering like as strong as I wanted it to since you know we've, we've lost trample We've lost like you're not gonna have to resolve like four hoaxes. It's probably one will be enough. Let's be honest here and Pocket watch Do we get it Okay changeling and now don't forget to not use the other card. Okay. Never mind. Never mind. So pop a tricks on the hoodwink get two more hoodwinks have way too many clown tricks Wait, how many were those? Um, I used one and then it got copied three times, like three times doubled. Oh, we get three times two back, so that's not a six. We use seven. That's 14 prank cards, and I don't know how many hoaxes we used, actually, and how many he discarded, so... That, but it's the reality. And we even drew all four hoaxes. That's a poker, if I call them. We actually float for Zen Blast. 
<laughs> this is such a meme run. Let's see how much damage this does. 67 damage and 70 with that. Okay, uh, that would have actually killed our opponent if I just used all four of them. And we even get another draw too? God, dude, this was, this is just, this is just so absurd. Like, now, let's say, okay, let's say you draw Arcane Prophecy. You either draw one card, you draw one card, or you draw Inspiration. Inspiration, or, or you draw a draw two, actually, and Inspiration gives you another chance on three draw twos. Three out of five, so, actually, this deck is gigantic. This is ginormous, 25 cards, man. What did we do to deserve this amazing deck? Oh, RNG's like, oh guys, oh yeah, yeah, I mean, it's mischief, right? Mischief, that's why. That's why, now we know. It has to be hand. It has to be mischief. If it wasn't mischief, what would, what else would it be? You know, let's, it has to be. Sure, let's draw two more cards. I mean, the only thing is that thing ex is exiled, so it's not gonna be forever, but... Oh, oh free flow, yes, sure. Um, oof, this is just... I can use trick, because then I can use the... You know, puppet tricks, I'm gonna call this the bed. So, let's poker it for free, just so we... Shrinking balloon and draw another two cards because of this thing. So now we only need... We only need this thing, so yes. Um, let's double the hook and have another way too many clown tricks. Now we can calculate because we have shuffled two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen prank cards, fifteen prank cards, sixteen prank cards, seventeen prank cards, and I mean this is not gonna FTK, but uh, we are we are pretty close. Let's be honest. Actually, can I? Can you use this three more, four more times? Two more times? One more time? Oh, we are we are amazingly close. No, come on! Oh no! Wait, 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 wait! I have this thing. Move one card. We can get hoax. Yo, oh, GG, GG, FTK, this guy. And as I told you, like the best class for FTKing is really just magician. You don't even need that other like build I did last time. We just got our own revenge. Retribution is what they call this. <laughs> aye. Aye, aye. You got really wrecked, man. I mean, you know what? For this occasion, I will even actually reread this thing. They mistakenly thought that one of the full moon night they could help the monsters quietly eliminate Little Red Riding Hood and her grandmother. Once the Hope family was wiped out, the legend of the lifting the curse on the black forest would disappear completely however they didn't expect they would have to go personally and pay such a high price to fight their enemy because they get hoaxed to the face with four hoaxes and, a, and like what seven seven clown tricks when the priest fell the cursed monsters reverted to their human forms and black forest was no longer covered by snow all year round but the church's blind greed still remained and we unlocked a new blessing. So, uh, escape magic for each counter card you use, your mana costs minus one this turn. That uh, that's gonna be helpful for the next for the next run with the magician. But uh, mis with mischief on our side, we fight and destroy everyone. So, as always, okay. You know what? There's one thing you pro it's probably the only thing you need to just keep in mind. Draw cards. Whenever there's a draw card that hasn't an insane cost, that draw card is worth playing because it will most likely be broken for deck. Look at this deck, for example. Charge off using, if you use two, any two spells, you draw two cards. Swift Strikes draws you a card. Uh, trick puts three cards. Okay, this is like a semi draw card, so it puts just three cards from your deck. It's like tutoring out cards, but whatever. I'm not counting it. Arcane Prophecy draws you another mana card, and you have more than enough. Uh, you have more than enough targets in deck. Wisdom draws you a card. Inspiration draws you a spell card, which are either draw cards or can trigger charge staff, which means it's not a draw combo. Possess draws you a card. It makes already six draw cards minus not counting trick. Portal draws you two cards. Prophecy gives you nets you a card from deck, so that's still the same. Changeling draws you three cards. 
uh, magic pocket draws you two and gives you actually a chance to draw what four more cards in the last chapter because you get a free turn. Pokedot again combo with charge stuff. Shrinking balloon and draws you two cards. And that's about it. Those are mostly draw cards that we have in deck. The only non-draw cards are actually Painful Strike, Clown Trick, Hoax, and Puppet Tricks. As well as... Okay, th these two you probably could have just banished these, let's be honest. Um, or actually, you know, Float didn't have necessarily to combo with Zen Blast. I could have just comboed with Mag po Magic Pocket Watch. Having like, what, a... 0.7 to the power of 3 to just miss. Okay, let's let's put it this way. You have 30% chance to uh, to get an extra turn. Or more so, you have a 70% chance to not get an extra turn. And having to trigger 0.7 or 70% 3 times mean, means... Uh, what's actually 7... Uh, 7 cubed. Oh man, 49 times 7. 50 times 7. 350 minus 7. Uh, 3... 343 so you have a yeah you have a 34.4 chance of not getting okay you have a one in three if you if you combo float with Mag magic pocket instead of having a 30 percent chance to get an extra turn you have a one in, ch in three chances to not get an extra turn so that's uh that's easy to remember right you just invert the probability right more or less like just uh, having having you know you don't have to calculate on percentage like if there's one or more one percent more or less that's uh, really not not the point but you know we have one enabler <laughs> that's actually like really the minimum the most really just did hoax on itself just by uh, since hoax just puts one more card you know there's there will probably never be a TCG in which one card just triggers its own engine. And just continuously draw more, does more damage. But probably if I if I were to design, uh, if I were to design a uh, trading card game, or just maybe even just a living card game, I'd probably just invent something like hoax because it's it's really just a fun idea to have. Like I really underestimated how much how much I would like it this thing, and I thought this this is gonna be like a hateful episode that I would never want to look back at. But hey, man, this this was. This was awesome. I mean, we were really, really lucky to get four hoaxes in, like in total, uh, one from upgrades, two from buying, and one as a blessing. Uh, this blessing, plenty is no plague. But yo, this thing is awesome. And um, yeah, man, it's a twenty-five card deck. But uh, what we have uh, twelve, thirteen draw cards, and actually even more. But uh, yeah, really fun, really fun. Now we actually should have gotten the. No, uh, we are we are on the right thing. Achievements, and I don't know actually what's it called, but uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. in addition to normal attacks, carry four identical cards. Yeah, that's that's it. That's it. The more, the better. Awesome. And by the way, I've I've done all the. Oh, this gives you only for the first six puzzles, right? Is there not not an achievement for all the puzzles? No, I, I did them all. Did them all right? Yeah, I did in the last one. This was really just the most difficult because everything is the same. Like, okay, most like most like the sh it's the same shade of brownish. <laughs> I uh, never mind. Yeah, guys, it was a really fun episode. I'm, I'm really hyped actually. I uh, probably if I have to f do a heart seven, I actually might even or heart seven with the magician. I might actually even do it with folks again. That's uh well, man. No amount of crying out China is gonna be enough for this hoax there. <laughs> so on this note, I'll be leaving you and I hope you will be there next time with a coffee too. And bye bye.